Hi everyone and welcome to another quick Goon Squad tutorial. My name is Zero and I'll be the one teaching you slash rushing you through another educational experience. These quick tutorials are meant to be used as reference points uh, to refer you to something that I may have asked you to do in another tutorial but didn't quite explain it to you, uh, explain how to do it. For example, I may have said extract your texture or export your shape or uh, grab the animation and didn't explain exactly how to do that. That's what these tutorials are meant to do. Fill you in so you can come over here and learn how to do it and then hop right back into the main tutorial because you know, you know how long these things take. So that's why these things are going so fast. If you need me to slow down um, or didn't quite catch what I said, please ask in the comment section and I'll try to answer you the best I can. Or you can go over to the Goon Squad website, goonsquad.co and there could should be a tutorial on whatever the hell I'm teaching you right now. So that aside, let's dive right into today's quick tutorial. And today's quick tutorial topic is how to extract your Second Life shape in XML format so that you can use it in Blender's Avastar plugin. So you can, you know, do everything that I do on there when I say extract your shape. Um, there are two ways to do it depending on what viewer you're using. If you're using a singularity view, uh, singularity based one, a viewer one style, you have to use a different menu. If you're using a Firestorm based viewer, which I'm using right now, you have to do this. So I'm gonna show you how to do it using the Firestorm based viewer. Um, what you do is press Control Alt D, or is it Control D, or is it Alt D? Damn Firestorm. There we go. Okay, so it's Control Alt D and activate the advanced menu. Then scroll down to the bottom and show click the show develop menu. With the develop menu activated, go to Avatar Character Tests and Appearance to XML. And then you're just gonna save it as my shape. And that's how you exp export your shape for use of Avastar. Now let's pause for a second and let's go over to a viewer one slash singularity style viewer where I can show you how to extract it that way. Okay so we're over here in singularity and this is a viewer one style viewer so how you activate the animation is actually by pressing the same keys control alt and then the D key and then go advanced character character test appearance to XML and then just save it again as you know here my sheet you'll get an error but just hit okay and then that's it so that's all you need to know on how to extract your shapes and how to collect shapes from others so if you need to talk to a client and ask them to extract their XML, just show them this and then, you know, save them in a folder and collect them like I do. <laughs> well, good luck on your projects and I hope that this helped you out. See you.